All right, now to the latest on the coronavirus pandemic. Many believe getting back to normal will take an effective and well distributed vaccine. Trials involving drug company Moderna are officially now underway here in Arizona. ABC 15's Cameron Polam has the latest on the race for protection. We actually just hit a milestone today where we've vaccinated our 100th subject. Dr. John McGettigan is heading up the Moderna coronavirus vaccine trials for Quality of Life Medical and Research Center in Tucson. Volunteers signed up by the thousands. So far, those who've received the vaccine range in ages from 18 to their late 80s. We've had a lot of uh, first responders, had a couple, uh, several nurses, Nurse practitioners, several physicians have come in. At least half will get the actual vaccine, the other half a placebo. In total, more than 200,000 Americans have signed up for the trial across the U.S. Each volunteer is closely tracked for side effects. Either through, uh, in, the, in our case, something called an electronic diary that asks them questions, or, and then it also we're going to be doing phone calls roughly once a week. And so far, those checkups seem promising. Some people are reporting absolutely nothing, but then we've had some folks report a sore arm. One, I remember one patient had some chills. He says vaccination and tracking will go on for months. The goal, prove it's effective and get it to the public. Now, not everyone is comfortable being a test subject for a vaccine, but TGen has a way for those who've had the virus to play a critical role. We designed the study specifically to get people who are you know, stuck at home but interested in participating. Folks who've had the virus and recovered can request this blood draw kit. A few drops of blood mailed back to researchers, potentially revealing answers to lingering questions. We analyze those, those blood samples to try and understand what type of antibody responses are, are being generated against this virus and how those things last over time, you know, how things look at month one versus month three. With the world depending on science at the moment, it could be Arizonans that hold the key at this historic crossroads. I'm Cameron Polam, ABC 15, Arizona. We're keeping our fingers crossed, Cameron. Thank you.